Good evening and welcome to our city. My name is Lenina Rasul. The Minister's decision on or about the 10th of June 2015 to table the Russian IGA before Parliament is unconstitutional and unlawful and it is reviewed and set aside. With these words, Judge Lee Bozelek put a judicial spoke in the wheels of the South African government's controversial push to build a one trillion rand fleet of new nuclear plants. His judgment in the Cape High Court on Wednesday set aside both the procurement process and a pre-agreement with Russia to supply the technology and build the plants. ESCOM had been charged with procuring 9,600 megawatts of new capacity to diversify its energy mix away from aging coal-fired plants. The proposal had been vigorously opposed by environmental, clean energy and civil society groupings and economists have warned that South Africa's ailing economy cannot afford to build the plants. After the judge made his ruling, the skies opened up on jubilant activists who had gathered on the steps of the court to talk about their historic victory. Top stories, court sets aside government's nuclear deal. Are unlawful and, cons and unconstitutional and are reviewed and set aside. We're really rejoicing, we really are. There's an incredible atmosphere. Um, everybody's just so excited. This is a complete, total, outright victory. The determinations have both been set aside, declared unconstitutional, as is the Russian agreement. The future is in our hands and we're not going to allow unjust energy decisions to be taken on our behalf. As a result of this court case, the people of South Africa have to be consulted. And we're just excited to just go forward. I mean, no to nuclear, that's, that's that, and there's nothing better than that. And nuclear is going to be disastrous for our planet, so we will rejoice now. We give thanks and rejoice. <laughs> A piece of paper that brings the nuclear deal for a halt, at least for now. Eh? It's now time to stand up and be counted. The struggle continues, it's not over. 